Hello, Joshua Gillow here from Master Plan Outdoor Living. Welcome back to Behind the Design. We created this series in order to help homeowners just like you get a better sense of what's possible outside. So uh, outdoor living is, it means a lot of different things to a lot of different people. And we wanna make sure you understand the design thought that goes into laying out a space like this. So today, what I wanna show you is uh, some appliances and storage options for an outdoor kitchen that we created here in Allentown, Pennsylvania. So heading over to this side of this, this kitchen, we created a nice long area here for prep and for storage. This is a lot of granite countertop down to the sink, but in this area here, you know, the, the base underneath is an Azac material that we painted that gives it a nice, smooth, clean texture uh, in this space, low maintenance, which is really cool. In this area, we used a nice barn wood, a nice finished barn wood with uh, metal handles and soft closed hinges, adjustable shelves inside, so you can store just about anything you can think of in there. And we did that in three areas. So there's plenty of storage in this, in this uh, kitchen. That's one of the key things to creating an outdoor kitchen is make sure you have plenty of storage. If not, you're going to be squirreling things away in different spots and it's just not going to be very convenient when you need those things. So again, storage is key. Next thing you got to think about is, all right, so whether you're out here with a party or just out here hanging out, there's going to be some garbage or trash that's created. So we want to make sure that that has been handled as well. And instead of just leaving some kind of a can out on the corner that looks hideous and then having to walk around it all the time, we incorporate that right into the kitchen cabinet space. So this is a rollout garbage area with uh, two different bins. One could be recycle, one could be regular trash, however you see fit. And then it slides back in and no one sees it or trips over it or doesn't fall over and the dog doesn't get into it either. So it's a nice way to keep that hidden and concealed. Uh, the next piece here is the uh, refrigerator. So we wanna make sure that the space is super convenient to use. And if you have to run all the way back into the house to that refrigerator to get uh, the ketchup or the pickles or whatever, and then you're gonna come all the way back out to the party, you're missing parts of the party. So when you're gonna do a full outdoor kitchen like this, you wanna make sure that refrigeration is part of the uh, thinking process as well. So as a designer, we wanna make sure that uh, these spaces are allocated with those refrigeration options as well. This one here again has uh, lots of space for drinks, has less space for condiments and all different things you might want to keep cold for an outdoor uh, party or get together or just in general. Um, the next piece here that we need to be th thinking about is once you know the party's done and we have to wash up plates, do you really want to be hauling them in and out of the house uh, in there to wash them and put them away and bring them back out for the next time when we can create you know, some nice wall cabinets in a, in a cleaning station or a sink area. So in this case, it's exactly what we did. So it minimizes how much inside outside we need to connect and how we can just utilize this space by itself so we don't miss any parts of the party. So again, we can see here, we can wash. We've got lots of, uh, you know, we have hot and cold water here, plumbing back into the house. And then up in these areas here, we can store things like our cups and mugs and things like that. And, and over here we have, you know, space for drinks and different things like that. And you can put plates in all around. So everything is at your fingertips. We also incorporated some lights up underneath to allow uh, for this space to be used in the evening as well. And you're not that you're searching around for things in the dark or expecting a big light to help uh, control that. So underneath here, we have access for the plumbing for the sink itself and also for cleaning products for the outside, kind of like you would inside of a house as well. Uh, another refrigerator for storing those nice cold drinks and then an ice maker so that you can come over here and grab as much ice as you need for your cold drinks or, or for anything else you need it for. It's making it right here um, as the party goes. No need to store it in a separate bin or a cooler or anything like that. That's all taken care of. In this area, here's our grilling station. So we have a nice 40 inch blaze grill, five burners, a uh, nice th thermostat on it to make sure we know what's going on inside there. So it makes it really easy to grill. You're part of the conversation. You wanna make sure that you aren't somewhere else far away with the grill, but it's nice and conveniently located within the design. Uh, we also included a microwave. So when you're sitting out here and your grandkids are watching TV and you wanna make some popcorn, you can grab it quick and cook it right here and sit out with them and watch the TV and not miss, uh, miss any parts of your favorite movie. So keeping everything outside is really a great way to be able to never miss a moment that we're out here with your family. So that's the nice part about incorporating things like that microwave uh, and the refrigerators and all of that. Lots of storage around the grill. We have grill utensils to think about. We have covers, we have all that stuff that needs to be hidden away. So all these areas here, they slide out, all these drawers and their soft clothes, another storage area, more soft clothes on this side. So that really helps, again, make this a space that you never have to leave. So I hope that helps. Uh, thanks for tuning in here on Behind the Design. Um, our goal is always to help you with visualization of the project. So if you have an idea for a project that you're thinking about for your property, uh, reach out to us. We'll help you visualize it first, guarantee that you're going to love a design that we create for you. And then once it's completed, the design's completed, we will then build it for you as well. 
So it's a nice turnkey uh, system that makes it super easy for you guys and uh, super fun for us as well. So thank you for tuning in and uh, tune in next time. We have a bunch more cool stuff coming from this, this location. Thank you.